How can we build software that is geometry aware? For example, if I want to send a streak of light through one of the corners, how do I ensure that it shows up on the correct LED strip? For this particular case, the challenge arises from the fact that LED strips pass data sequentially along the strip from one LED to the next. To add in another section, we must append it to the end of the original strip. If we try to add another section of LEDs midway, we end up with the data being passed to both strips and the output is duplicated. There is no way for us to tell the LED strips to split the data between the two independent strips at a midpoint. This shape is a rhombic dodecahedron, and there is no way to get a single string of LEDs to wrap all the way around without overlapping. This is just a simple animation that shows where a streak of light would go if it were simply passed along the linear data stream. As you can see, there are often quite large jumps between two LEDs that are sequential in the data stream. I tried a few methods to solve this problem. The first method was to not solve it at all. I call this animation Starry Night. An LED is selected at random to be lit up, and then all LEDs are dimmed by some amount each frame. I call this animation Gears. It's not very geometrically aware either. Every frame a single pattern is applied to each LED strip. Then it is advanced slightly in time for the next frame. The pattern is created such that the beginning matches up with the end. Yep, apparently I like the unicorn vomit color scheme. This animation is called Dueling Unicorns. It is a bit more geometrically aware. Here, information like the ID number for each LED at a node is stored in an array. This allows the program to know the ID number of the LED a streak of light is going from and to. I discuss how this method works in more detail in a different video. This is my final animation, the expanding sphere. Imagine a ball with a single color on its surface that is expanding. As the ball passes through an LED, the LED will output that color, except with layers upon layers of balls expanding out, each with a different color. This process can be modified to use any 3D shape, like a cube or a pyramid. If you'd like to check out another rhombic dodecahedron infinity mirror, I highly recommend Malt Whiskey's channel. He has built a couple of his own along with some LED cubes that are absolutely phenomenal.